Hello everyone, Timer over here, and welcome back to another video for Satisfactory. My goodness, a lot has changed since the last video. Um, believe it or not, I do apologize for not getting a video out yesterday, but uh, I had one recorded. Turned out to be a pretty long video, but I was not too happy with it, um, and so I scrapped it. However... Um, not much was done in the video in terms of uh, what you missed. Basically, we I just sort of fixed up the steel industry and then I ultimately tore it down anyway and rebuilt it. So it's not like any of that really uh, impacted anything. What you're seeing here, um, the changes made were, I believe, done... Um, in between episodes uh, the majority of these changes so the I have a couple buildings now in our general area uh, that we started at our main base and most of these are still intact they're a little bit different I moved our power over to this building right here to free up some areas along the the center area and this big building in the center here this is our new uh, inventory stockpile um, and of course over here is our current copper production area and this these two buildings are basically there as um as i'm not entirely sure what you are now that i think about it this is where all of our ore and whatnot are coming in um so yeah, I have to figure what the this building is right there. I'm not entirely sure. I think it used to be a uh, uh, inflow of, of materials, but not really anymore. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. This is by no means uh, finalized. I just wanted to get it a little bit more organized in between episodes. We will be rebuilding all of this um, in, a, in a future episode. As you can see, our iron production really hasn't changed all that much. In fact, it hasn't changed at all. Um, I did start production on a couple different things. Um, mainly, if we pop out of here, out of observer mode, whoa, and uh, I'm just gonna go there and get us back on the floor. Um, we now have some automated wiring. I think this is enough for our space elevator uh let's see 100 200 300 400 Ooh, so close all right well we'll have to hopefully get that resolved 100 200 300 400 500 okay so we have enough of these so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take all of those And let's run over here and get these put into the space elevator. Woo! Uh, there. Okay. And then we'll overshoot that. Overshoot it again. Third time's a charm. Okay. And then come back over here. I'm going to tear down this sure that one still needs a few items what are we missing in here uh looks like cables have any stashed in here i don't think so okay so let's go into our storage area here real quick um so this is what we've got going on boop 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 is this is our new storage area it has everything in it we've got cables here wire we've got copper sheets we've got uh, steel beams and uh, steel pipes and then concrete and we haven't really but done much on this well actually these two are empty they're not hooked up to anything we've got uh, screws we've got iron <coughs> iron bars um, hardened iron plates and then iron plates so all of this is being fed um, under here so if we pop down here you can see all of our incoming products are coming under the base and being diverted into their respected storehouses uh, so on this side as you can see i have smart smart splitters here 
that are filtering out where each of these goes and any overflow goes straight through here up back up there into a, a sink so that's what we've got going as far as inventory management at the moment and i can't get up there all right well, we'll uh, have to find another way up we have a ladder over here somewhere there we go do, 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 do. Go on. Get up there. All right, let's take a look. What is this? Ah, right. That's a miner. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. Um, okay, so we need... We need to grab some cabling. Uh, just give me all of that. and go into there so hopefully that will be all we need to get phase two completed and done uh, what's in here anything new i think these were just rotors yeah rotors okay tell you what um can i yeah, motors, this is going to need rotors and stators. Hmm. I actually think we'll keep this going. As some rotor production. At least for the time being. But I do need... stators and you just need wire all right so let's grab that and what i'd like to do today is get some production started on um on silica uh because now that we've unlocked and I've, i have unlocked quite a bit uh we unlocked quite a bit la in the episode that i i ditched um and we'll take a look here soon go ahead and throw those in you can take those. Just give me a bunch more staters so that I can toss them into this at some point and start making some motors. Uh, because if we look at our map, I think we have a hard drive up here that I've not yet triggered. So we're going to want to go up and get that as soon as we have some motors. But today we're not doing that. What we're going to do today is go set up a quartz um, production area over in the quartz area. So if we pop out here, what I should do, actually, is this ready yet? Oh, that's going to take a while, isn't it? Yeah, all right. Well, we'll put that off for a little bit. We... Uh, what are my resources looking like here? Got plenty of silica. Got some of those. Got some cabling. I don't think I need all of these modular frames. Let's uh, let's do an inventory dump real quick. Do 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 do. Sort. Um, go in there. Go. Ah, uh, we will take the iron. I don't need those, and we can dump a few of those. I'll have to grab some steel beams and steel pipes, but other than that, I think we're we're in good shape. Oh right, uh, I forgot we need to set up the line. I was doing some tinkering over in the steelworks area uh, and never actually connect reconnected our um, our production areas here. So let me run over there real quick and take a look at that. And we can actually take a look at the progress being made on improving um, our steelworks. It's not it's not completed yet, but we do have enough in there that it's actually starting to take shape um as you can see that 
bus is is actually enclosed is looking better this is going to be enclosed as well at some point in between episodes when i can sort of uh you know get it enclosed um, but we do have the windows up and running so we did unlock those so here is the new and improved steelworks area looking looking much nicer room to expand it's all being housed within one building right now because we don't have the resources to, to funnel um, everything in there. Whoa. Let's get up here. Come on. Jump, jump, jump. All right. So. Random wall mount over there as well as way up there, apparently. But let's uh, let's head up. You can take a look inside. Okay, that <laughs> that uh, ladder does absolutely nothing. Okay, so this is the entry. You're overlooking our iron production, or not iron production, iron mining. That building there and down there is just for aesthetic purposes and to cover up the majority of the iron uh, belting that's under there. The iron mine itself is coming. I don't know. Yeah, is coming over here. So everything is being belted underneath this platform. So if we take a look here, there you go. That's all being filtered into there. And then I cut it out, I cut it out. That needs to be addressed. Um, a little slit right here. So I'm not gonna remove that, but as you can see, woo, let's, uh, can I get up onto this thing? There we go. We all right. So this little slit down the center here. This is where the iron's coming in, and then it's going to go up the lifts up into there to feed our our um, foundries. So that's working out pretty nicely. Um, I think I do want this. Let's just go and put this in real quick while I'm thinking about it, and then let's grab some walls. And this needs to be concrete. And then do 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 there. Nope, that one. Okay, much better. Alright, let's pop back up and take a look at the inside. Whee. Okay, so no roof yet. But it's it's coming along nicely. We still have the same amount of production area, so it's not a massive deal. Uh, did I not actually set these up? There we go. You looks like you are connected. Yes, you're powered, right? Yeah, good. You are not. Okay, are you powered? New. No. Good. Oh wait, that's my that's my other avatar. Hello, buddy, way up there. Wee. Okay, so you're going there. And there we go. I think this should be producing. Hmm. 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 Ah, well, there's there's part of the problem. Let's bring you on in. There you go. Excellent. So, are you going to get iron as well, or did we not do something? Did I forget to do something with the iron? Let's pop down here. Check the underside of this. you not connected here or did i not set ah, i did not okay so this is going to be iron ore and iron ore overflow there we go now it should be now it should produce 
Yes. No, maybe. Yep, there we go. Perfect. So they're going to feed into these machines over here. And then these machines are going to feed into here, which apparently I did not get set up. Let's go there. And then put you right here. Like that. Alright, so are we getting some steel? We are. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Alright. And you... You have a bunch of steel on you. Uh, let me just go and knock that down. Come in here. Let's say... Here and there. You're gonna grab that. And we'll grab this, flip it around. Come up here and hopefully there's not ah, yeah there's a bunch of stuff. Uh store all. Take all. And then we'll just dump this into that storage area and then head on over to the quartz mining. I do have something set up over there, but what I have set up over there is just... Um, what is this? It's a merger. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha! Like, why is nothing being processed here? Ugh, there's a crate over there. Because I del deleted it without first putting these in there. Great. Um, but now we should have this. There we go. 60, 30, two, two, okay, so that should be good. How much are we making? 45 per minute. Yeah, that, that's working, because that's going to be 90 and uh, should be okay there. That's a number level two? Yes. Perfect. Alright, let's go get our stuff and then we can head on out. After we connect these up. I'm just going to do this lazily. And I will fix it in between episodes here. But for now, that's gonna have to be okay. Me. Take all. Alright, do I want anything from in here? Let's grab a couple of those. I do have the the cables, so I don't really need those. Alright, I think that's that's good. Alright, where are we going here? Let's look at the map. Over here. Highlight marker. 
so far away. All right, well, I will uh, head on over there and we'll be right back in just a second. And here we are. So this is the area. I don't think we've actually shown this off yet um, because really there's not much to see. <laughs> it's just a little factory that's basically just being synced. Uh, but we're going to actually repair this a little bit today. Or not repair, but make it a little better. We've got a couple of silicon, or quartz I should say, uh, mines. we got one there, one over there, and one right here um, that we can set up. And I think they're all normal, if memory serves correctly. If we pop out of photo mode, go to the map here. Uh normal times four yeah i think there wow there's four really where's the uh where's the fourth there's one there one there one there uh one over there pretty far away so yeah relatively just realistically we just got three right now um that we're gonna sort of set up in this in this uh setup here um i'm gonna expand these a wee bit because i'm gonna want a fairly large platform we got one two three four five um, i guess we could cut it at five which is sort of what I've been going on. How big is this platform? We got one, two, although this one's not going to really count unless we turn these around. We could also go high. Whoops. Ooh, come on, get up there. Unless we want to move this elsewhere, like maybe over here in this large area over here could be good. Um, alternatively, we could do it sort of like over here and go out. I actually kind of like that. Prospect. Yeah. Which way do we want to go? I think. I'm going to want to go straight out that way. We can build this on the edge here. Um, five. We want to go, probably want to go up a little bit, huh? So I'm going to try to do a similar sort of setup to what we have at the, um, at the steelworks. At least sort of the same general outline. Uh, da -da -da -da. So, yeah, you're going to cause some issue, but that's fine. 10. Jump up here so it's a little bit easier to, to gauge these. Go up to there. I think we're gonna want to go up a little bit more. I don't want these rocks in our in our way. So let's do that. That five looks like it. Indeed. All right, let's grab you. Do 
something like that with the end products heading out to be belted over here. Uh, shoot. Ah! <laughs> Ledge was, uh, I was hoping for a little bit closer. Um, I'm wondering if we have anything that I could connect, like, diagonally. I'll have to check our... I don't... Well, I mean, we do have... Um, metal beams and, and whatnot now. No. You know, these can't be diagonal. Yeah, yeah, look at that. We could have... I mean, this is just ball in here but like we could have sort of like support structures like that so maybe we'll do that something different um i need a ladder to get us back up there okay so we've got this this is going to be our output i should say uh give me this go to two This is the center one, so I'm going to go down to one. Uh, maybe we'll do something different. Let's do this this one on the end here. See what we can come up with. Okay, I think that's a good good starting point. Um, I want all these to be, oh my gosh, are you serious? I don't have concrete. Well, that is a bit of a annoyance. Is there any concrete around here? I don't think so. All right. Well, I will be right back and gonna have to go get some concrete. All right. We are back and we've gotten a concrete platform. Um, so let's go ahead and get our walls up. I want these walls. Um, before we do that, let's make sure to get our cavities, our wall cavities set up and marked. Uh, so go here, here, drop a concrete pillar over here and drop a concrete pillar and do the same this might be a little bit big um probably don't need something this massive for what we're going to actually ultimately put in here but eh, it's fine all right um i'm gonna go here there might put uh, this one might be all glass at least on top these uh, you because i'm going to do the uh, wall cavities i don't want to put the um the glass on the lower ground floor so we'll just leave it be as this um, should be good and then i think the in's going to be over here. So let's grab our bear. Oh, do I want two? No, we'll, we'll just split it when we come in here and that's going to be fine. Do that. Uh, that's good. And then to get the wall cavity, let's go into our build architecture and grab our road barrier. And I'm just gonna mark this here, here. You're not gonna let me do that, are you? There we go. Go that way. Ooh, this way, I don't think I need... Yeah, that end's probably not going to get anything. Um... 
it's not gonna have a double wall. We're just gonna have the the walls the double walls on this end. I actually don't need that one, do I? Need it over here. Alright. So that is good. Now, power, I think I'm going to put the power over here. Um, so I'm going to use the double wall, and we don't have enough copper. Lovely. Lovely. That is best planning ever. Um, and I probably don't have any um, production area for copper. Um, no, we've got nothing. Do we have some nearby? Probably not. As that would be... Yep, nope. My gosh, that's like super far away. Alright, well, I guess I'm going to have to go get some copper. Be right back. All right, we are back and we have some copper wire. Let's do the double wall outlet. Put that here. That is going to be our um, our in, I suppose. Uh, do I want that there or do I want it on the concrete pillar? I think I want it on the concrete pillar. I guess it doesn't really matter. It'll look better there. Um, so let's keep it there. I'm going to put you here. You there. And then we're going to tear this down and connect these up. Uh, sometimes it's a little, it's a little wonky. Come on. We're going to go there. You are going to go there. Okay, and then we can put the concrete wall back in. And there's our power. Excellent. Um, and we're going to want another one over here. But not on the wall side. We're just going to do the interior here. So again, we're going to do there one there remove this lump in the power lines and put that back in good stuff and then those will run down that way and so on and so forth let me run that over there Um, I guess that's okay. It's not going to be super noticeable, so I guess I'm fine with that. There we go. And pop out here. So we got two normals. Let's see what we've got in terms of production. We've got 60. We've got three total. So that's going to be 180 rock quartz. So that is good to know. So we'll need a tier 3 belt. Alright, tell you what. This needs to be, say, over here. So I can do that. Alright, so it's going to come in here. Let's see how we're going to set this up. Destructor. So I'm going to want... I think I'm going to want both, huh? Um, we're going to want both. So do we want, do we want quartz? Is there any, we'll probably need a trickle of quartz. And the way I figured it before was one 
quartz and one silica will take a normal flow because I think that's yeah I mean that's pretty much running 100 and uh, or 60 total because you are 37.5 and you are 22.5 that adds up to 60 so that's yeah well, at most we're going to be running this um that being said I don't think we need that much of this so I might only run one of these. But how much is that? Okay, so we can run two of these. Or sorry, four of these. We're going to do that. Although this, is that enough space? I think... I think so. Let's put down our splitters here first. Um, but I want us to do something different. Hmm. <laughs> no, I think we'll split it like this. Just because um, we're going to have the two separate locations. Uh, I'm going to do a smart splitter. I want this to be lined up with our intake here. Okay. Uh... That's not far enough. Do something like that. Okay, that, even that might not be far enough. Um, yeah, we're going to need to go further. So I do like the center to be opened. So let's just put a scooch up one and give that a try. Okay, I think that works. Although, did I not flip you around yet, yeah, of course not. Uh, all right, go there. We're gonna go there and grab you and move you over a bit because I don't like these being so close together. And uh, you're gonna make silica, silica. And we can adjust these as needed. Um, and then we're going to run one of these. Although... Hmm... Just wondering if we want to put that at the end of this belt. Either that, or maybe we set this one up to be a little bit more of a load balancer. Eh, that's all right. Nah, it's alright. Maybe we'll do something... Um, if we can. If that's going to give us enough room. Come on. Hmm. 
Yeah, we're going to have to separate them on one side and the other. Uh, crystal quartz. Is it that you... What do we need this for? I mean, we're not using it right now. But we will need some of it. So, a trickle. Hmm. I'm thinking rather than doing four of these, we just double up. That way there's no leftover products because we would have a little bit left over if we um, if we did it this way. This way, turn it around. You're going there. There, merger, splitter. <laughs> okay, and then up top we want it to be a smart splitter here. This doesn't necessarily matter. Uh, da -da -da. And I'm doing it this way mainly to save room, I suppose. The other way I was doing it was a better lo was load balancing better, um, but it was taking up so much room, and I had to figure all this stuff out, and I didn't really feel like doing this anymore. <laughs> so it'll it'll all work out still fine. It's just going to be a matter of um, it's going to take longer for the machines to kick on, but then they'll be running efficiently and, and so on and so forth. Uh, I just use it. Darn it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Two. Three. And then we're going to need a th level three here, followed by a level three belt. Uh, level three belt there. that there okay so those are going to be silica, silica, silica. Yes. Uh, silica. And then on this side, we are going to have... Crystal Quartz. Crystal Quartz. And those are Crystal Quartz. Excellent. And then I might actually rain this building in a little bit uh because doesn't guess it doesn't need to be this massive so i'll probably do that in between episodes because we're running a little bit long um but we can squeeze in these mergers over here and i think for right now all i'm gonna do is put in a something like this just to get these things producing. Um, let's upgrade that. And mergers. Whoa. There. One, 
two and put another one of these over here for right now. Okay. So far, so good. Um, you're right there, so we're going to plop you here. There. And there. Power up. Gonna do the same thing. Uh oh, completely off there. All right, on this side. Connect up. Goal for today is just to get this up and running. We'll detail it later on. Um, go down this. Jump. Come on. There we go. Okay. Um, so then we need, is it over here? Yeah, there it is. I need my power. That should get power feeding into these things. Yes, good. So now we just need the actual ore. So unfortunately, these are going to be taken up, but that is entirely fine. Production at its best here. So now I remember why I had that storage container. Okay, let's put this back so that dump that that um, anything else I want to get rid of uh, I don't have very many steel bars left <laughs> all right grab you grab this stuff there I should check how many um, things we have. Uh, take all. Take all. How many tickets, I should say. Uh, get rid of those. Whoa. Yeah, how many tickets? Hey, we've got six. Nice. Okay, grab you. Dump those in. And I'll leave this here just as a, um, a platform for our, our miners. Uh, but we're going to turn this around. We're going to go this way now. me all those and yeah this thing too because we're not going to need it over here
And I need crafting bench. No, not a crafting bench. I always do that. I'm like, I need a equipment workshop, for crying out loud. All right, uh, one portable miner, please. Okay, give me that. This is going to go here. Um, let's see if we can align this a little bit better. And then give me a merger. Oof, that's going to be... Oh, wait. Come on. I saw it. There it is. Okay, and then... Another one over here. Um, let's get it aligned. With this one and then see if maybe we can adjust that. Yeah, that actually looks like it lines up perfectly. You're going to go there. And that, and then switch to a three. And then we just need power and we can put a cut in the video. Um, let's go there. Go ahead, connect with that. I'm hoping we still have plenty of power. Alright, that is going to end it for today. Um, and yeah, I think we'll try and finagle this next episode a little bit more and get it all looking a little nicer. But the, the, bare, minute, the, bare, the bare essentials are here and uh, it should be functional. Knock on one. Anyway, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. If you are, let me know by hitting that like button. If you want to see more content, as always, I strongly encourage you to subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, we'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.